Now at 6, police in Colorado Springs say more than a dozen people were hurt in last night's shooting at Club Q. Several of them are in critical condition tonight, and one of the people shot at that gay nightclub has ties right here to the triangle. Candace Cox said seven bullets hit her friend in the back as he attempted to run away from the shooter. Cox's friend said that happened just moments after the gunman shot another person at the club in the face at point blank range. Five people were killed in that club, 18 wounded, including Cox's friend, who was said to be there on vacation. My friend took off running towards the back door and got hit seven times um, and made it outside and somehow made it over the little fence and landed in the parking lot of the 7-Eleven that they keep showing and called his father because um, he thought he was he was dying because he was bleeding out and everything. So he called his father to tell his father goodbye. Mm, Cox's friend was rescued by a couple who saw him lying there in that parking lot. Uh, he's since undergone surgery. Well, a local bar owner here in Raleigh now calling for better gun laws. It's a travesty that could be avoided um, easily uh, by voting for non-anti-queer, transphobic, uh, queerphobic politicians, uh, prioritizing uh, people's uh, safety by uh, voting for better gun control. The gunman was taken over by some people at the club before police arrived just a couple of minutes uh, after the shooting started.